Right, we're going to take the covers off. Are you ready, mate? Hi guys and welcome back to Archie Hamilton Racing and welcome to what is going to be a seriously exciting video ahead. You join me where I'm currently in Cheltenham where I'm just about to, well I have departed, I'm too used to saying that, I've departed and today we are collecting my friend's new car slash supercar. It's a very cool day out and today is not about me, it's about him and uh, the moment he called me up and he said you'd never guess what I've bought due to me being a little bit jealous to what you currently own I've gone and purchased something a little bit similar but different but would you like to come along with me and I said I would absolutely love it and let's go and collect your car today well what I have done is my Porsche is currently getting fixed at the moment the rear window problem um, and I left my wallet in the Porsche I've had to go via uh, Porsche Centre come here it's been a bit of a nightmare journey but we're currently just around the corner from where the dealership is and we are going to go and take the covers off uh, his car today and we're also dropping off his old car which he's actually replaced i'm going to show you that as well so let's enjoy the day so a little bit of a different location to where i usually start my videos it's very peaceful where we are here in cheltenham i've never been here before but it's uh, a very nice place uh, if you ever do come down, down here but one car which is over here and this is the car which uh, we are dropping off uh, before he goes and collects his new one and this is this car just right there. We've just parked up. There it is. I'm gonna show you this car right now because it is very, very cool. So here is my friend's old car, which we're gonna be dropping off at Porsche Tewkesbury. And this is a Porsche GTS and I love them. I think they're very, very cool. Perfect for the daily. He's absolutely loved it as a daily driver day to day, but you'll see what he's upgraded to. And it is a little bit different to this uh, in a very good way, put it that way. But this is cool, isn't it? It just looks amazing. And as a daily driver, you can't really beat that. Roughly a hundred grand, um, pretty ball if you ask me. And oh, carbon, carbon fiber mirrors, we, we do like them very much. But what he has done is at the back here, you can see he's actually deleted the uh, the Porsche uh, name from the back and I think it actually looks quite cool it looks different but they are just very very understated and you can park that on the side of the road and sort of it's very understated but cool as well if you know what I mean seriously baller but we'll jump in this and uh, we will head on our way to go and collect the new edition and we've just arrived and this is where we are just uh, get do you want to get on camera no, nah. nah, he doesn't want to get on camera. The main man doesn't want to get on camera yet, but we are here at, uh, there's a certain gentleman, Mr. Darren Gibson here as well. Uh, but we're here, we're at Porsche Tewkesbury where we're just about to collect the car. And uh, it's a very rainy day, very wet weather, uh, which is not great, but the car is just behind us, uh, just under there, undercover, and we're gonna show you what is there as well. But in here, there are some amazing cars. So we're gonna have a little tour around. And as I own a GT3 RS, I'm a massive Porsche, Porsche, I better get this right before I get any uh, hate in the comments. Porsche lover. Um, so we're gonna go inside and uh, we're gonna show you what's here because there's just some amazing stuff. That is a Turbo S exclusive series. That is awesome. That is very, very cool. We're in, we are in. Let's push these doors more. And then, oh yes. So we're inside here and there are some amazing cars as you can see, but I'm gonna give you a little tour around uh, what is around and over there there's a certain couple of cars which you are going to see as well um but yeah first of all 911 very cool uh, but if we walk a little bit further on this color looks absolutely amazing doesn't it this 911 carrera s in this green which just pops out at you i really do like that that is uh, a seriously cool bit of kit mr darren gibson hello sir would you like to be in the video Finance guru. How are you, mate? How are we? Good to see you. Good. Another deal over the line? Are you a busy guy? Yeah. I agree. You are a busy guy, but you like this car, don't you? I love this car. The one that he's bought. I love the client who's buying it. Yeah, the client he's bought. He's a, he's a good old boy. We're going to show more about that. But good to see you, Darren, as always. It looks amazing from the back, doesn't it? Panamera. Massive fan of the Panamera, especially uh, the hybrid version. Genuinely, as a daily driver, um, they are totally, totally epic but one car which we're going to go and see or two cars we're going to go and see before we go and see the actual car uh, which my good friend has gone and bought come with me because right here is where we just look at them and we're like oh yes first of all gen 2 gt3 rs and uh, the gentleman here was actually just telling me that this man he's actually done no miles in it he bought it and then after he bought it he realized that he wanted one with a vice pack so he's actually putting this one up for sale so this is a 
Yeah, I mean, I, I get it, but do I get it? Not really, but anyway, this is this one's up for sale and they are still going for over list. And I actually just said to him, uh, the gentleman, the salesman working here, I said, I've got a generation one GT3 RS, is that gonna hold money? And he's like, in fact, that might be going up in value. And I was like, we like that chat. Let's have a look at these two parked up together, the generation two RS in the very nice colour it was like launched in. Uh, the green does look very, very cool. But generation two, yeah, it's slightly different to my one. Obviously you've got these uh, sort of vents on the front. There's just little things around the Nürburgring, roughly 10 seconds faster than my car. Um, but this, as you can see with the price, 212,000 pounds, yours only. But it's stunning. And what it also has, carbon fiber mirrors and uh, the wing is actually slightly different I did notice it from this side actually you can see here the wing is actually slightly different very green interior as well but uh, yeah I'm a fan I'm a big fan if we walk a little bit further on we have the daddy of all daddies and very actually cool to see both of these parked up next to each other G2 RS and G2 RS because these are the kings kings of the ring let's say um, because they really are and um, I've driven a GT2 R, uh, GT2 RS and loved it and uh, the difference is they're, they're just they are different cars very different um, but £400,000 you can see this one is uh, currently for sale for but look at that isn't that just an awesome bit of kit it just absolutely is I just love this specific color as well the silver with all the carbon because it really just shows out the carbon as well um, and the sort of bronzy gold wheels that you have on here as well it's just uh, it's epic it's absolutely epic Look at all the carbon just absolutely everywhere oh I love it and a very kind gentleman here has just opened it up so I can uh, show you guys inside it <laughs> now we're in because this is one of the lowest mileage GT2 RS's there is in the country. I'm just looking at the dial now and I can't quite believe it because I'm used to seeing mine is still low mileage. This, ladies and gentlemen, has 12 miles on it. 12! I mean, that is mad, isn't it? It's so nice. The steering wheel as well, the very nice red with the black on the top. And then the 918 seats, but you've got a Visac. RS in there and also not too dissimilar like driving position wise to my car but you've got these amazing carbon fiber paddles it's just it's better isn't it cheesy to RS so what we're gonna do, go do now is I'm gonna show you the car my friends bought he's gone and bought a generation 2 Porsche GT3 um, so I'm yeah I'm massively happy for him and uh, it's it's always cool to be here and just see it all uh, happen we turned up to the dealership actually he was just like shaking just like I can't believe it I can't believe it because it's just such an occasion and a generation 2 GT3 is such a cool bit of kit it really is and uh, yeah, he's gonna have a lot of fun in that car. So let's go take the covers off and show this because in my eyes, this is a supercar because it's it's got that feeling, it's got that rawness, it's got everything about it. It's it's crazy. So the fact that these are 150, 160,000 pounds, he's collecting a supercar. Uh, this is sold, the Turbo S exclusive. And this man who's bought this car, he's decided that he's purchased this car. I think it's around 280,000 pounds to add because it's an exclusive Turbo S, to add 15,000 pounds worth of carbon fiber wheels is gonna be going on this car right here. So he's absolutely smashed that. It's so cool, isn't it? And the fact that that is 280,000 pounds, but looks unbelievable with all the carbon and everything else. And this is sold. So a lucky gentleman is gonna be getting that car very shortly with his new 15,000 pound wheels, but it's time. Right, Darren, what we got behind there, mate? Go on then. Special. Come on, there he is. Come on, you get in there. Come oh, on, you, he, on, he, on. you get him in there. This man's bought the car, everyone. Only because of him. <laughs> Only no, of him. No, Darren's no. forced him into it's it. It's my fault, it's your fault. It's, it's my fault. <laughs> no, mate, that's your new car. That is oh, your new car yeah. under there. This is it. This is his new GT3. And you're, you are quite camera shy, aren't you? A bit camera shy. Um, have you seen the You haven't seen the car? I haven't seen it. I haven't seen it at all. This is exactly what I did with. The orange. <laughs> <laughs> at this point it could be, but this is how Dean did it, a red line, and I had no idea, but this is the best surprise you're going to get. I've copied Archie. Yeah, yeah, he, he's a fan. That can happen, can't it? Right, we're going to take the covers off. Are you ready, mate? Go on. I'll do it here, you stand in there, right, and then you can see it. Ready? Right, ready. I'll, just, I'll, I'll pull it, and then you stand there. Yes. Yeah. 
That is set. Amazing. Absolutely. Look, it's awesome. Absolutely. That is set as well. Right, I've just taken the camera back. Look at this. This is my friend's new Porsche GT3. It is absolutely stunning, isn't it? With the black with the grey wheels. Generation 2. Look, everyone's all very happy around here, but it's very cool. I think the front lift is currently up, but doesn't that just look absolutely awesome? It's just such a cool bit of kit. I really, really love these cars so much. Oh, when you look at it from here as well, you can just see it from here and how cool they look from this angle oh we will talk a little bit about the spec of this car uh, this has uh, the club sport package on it that basically means that you get the ceramics etc ceramic brakes some of them come with steel but uh, yeah so this has that you have here at the front you can see it's got a front lift so it's got a full front lift, sy lift, lift system, which is cool. And uh, you do also on this car have parking sensors. That's another thing. And reversing camera. Not all Porsches come with reversing cameras, by the way. You've got the buckets. So when we open up here, we'll be able to see. You've got the bucket seats. So here we go. That's another option as well. And also what is another option is the carbon fiber, which you have like little things like here, like carbon. Uh, that's not standard. Um, so it is fully, fully kitted out. And... Uh, it's got absolutely everything on it, this car. And it's absolutely awesome to see his reaction and uh, work really hard for it. And I think that's one of the things when you come along to collection days, etc., and you see people uh, successful and get cars like this, you see, it just makes it that extra little bit special. I get to be his passenger all the way back to London as well, because yeah, we're just going to have a really nice cruise on back. But it's. Uh, not the best weather at the moment, that is for sure. Just talking to the guys here, you could drive around in that for a year, and you don't need to worry about depreciation. They're pretty, pretty damn solid. You could potentially sell that for the same price, and that's just how cool and how amazing Porsche are doing it at the moment. Right, we're heading on our way. Look what's coming out. Here it is. Here is the GT3 coming out, and oh yes. Yes, here it is, and I'm gonna be passenger on the way home how good does it look it looks absolutely unbelievable super happy for him what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna jump in head on my way home but from me i'm gonna round this video off and i'm gonna just enjoy it and hopefully we'll see more of this car shortly um because yeah we're gonna plan on doing road trips all sorts in this car and you'll see a lot more of it on my channel uh we've even just been talking to like we need to do a road trip gt4 s and gt3 we need to do that anytime soon but the weather is horrendous so we're gonna focus have a nice safe drive home in the rain there we go, better go. See you all very soon.